Hello my lovely humans, welcome back to another fabulous video on my channel. I am bringing you Sims 4 Cats and Dogs. I am recording this on midnight, which I was not planning on doing. Actually, it's 40 minutes after, but I was not planning on doing it. I was going to do it tomorrow, but I've been really sick, and so I'm like, I can do it. It's fine. It's whatever. Okay, but we're here. I'm People Fly Fly Away, where I'm like, well, you've never seen me before, and so I'm happy to be bringing you this content. Um, I post videos every single day. Sims is my life. It's the thing that gets my anxiety down. It's everything I, I, I know. And so I'm super duper excited to have cats and dogs in my life. I've had it pre-ordered for the two past two months, and I've been waiting for this moment for like ever. I'm just I've been so excited ever since the leaks and everything, you know, touch times in um, the in that part. But we're gonna talk about. Since we're cats and dogs, I do want to talk about my coverage real quick so you guys are very much aware. So if you want to stick around for the whole weekend, I recommend you do. Um, we are posting, I'm having four separate videos come out because or it's going to be just one big, like, an hour and a half long review. And I'm just not a big fan of those. Um, I like shorter reviews of each and every section. So we're going to go through each and everything here, basically, maybe, just a little. So we're going to create... We're gonna have a crate pet, and we're gonna have crate um, a cast video where it talks about everything we can do with crate pet and what we, everything we can do with cast. Then we have an object video, and then we're gonna have a world tour because Brendleton Bay is amazing. I've heard rumors. I've not watched anything on this. This is my genuine reaction. And then on top of that, my LP for cats and dogs will start on the 13th, which is Monday. So if you want to tune into that, you very well can. There's going to be a big catch up on because it's season two of an LP I did before. And so I'm following these characters. There will be a big catch up. No worries there. I just, I'm super excited. Okay. What's, what's look, welcome to Sims 4 Cats and Dogs. If I run over my words, it's just because I'm super excited. So create cats and dogs. Use powerful create a pet tool to explore the, use, to explore your creativity as you customize your Sims perfect cats, dogs, puppies, and kittens. Choose from varieties of breeds, give them distinct personalities, and directly manipulate their features. Bond with your pets. Experience the companionship and fun that furry friends bring to your Sims lives. Cats and dogs have minds of their own and form special relationship with Sims based on their daily interactions. Become a vet and run a clinic. Now, veterinary clinics, I'm, I'm kind of iffy about, so we'll talk about that more um, in my LP. Um, I'm really hoping that someone can run a vet in your world and but you don't have to you don't have to run it yourself where you can go there and bring your sick dog that's my hope um i personally don't want to run a clinic i will if i have to um maybe at some point in the lp we can run a clinic but i'm very story based i don't think i'll just have a good time with it personally but who knows i mean i do have one person set up to maybe be a veterinarian in my lp so it's a possibility so don't roll it out i'm just a little nervous but we are going to check it out obviously but become a vet and run a clinic, build a veterinary clinic, hire a dedicated staff and further your careers as town's most promising animal doctor. You're in control of daily operations from services offered to what you charge. And also, we've seen this time and time again, yet this is for dogs, which makes it a little more interesting and more fun, I guess. Then explore Brindleton Bay. The most looked forward thing I have about this whole entire LP is Brindleton Bay. I love the look of Brindleton Bay. It brings me happiness. I mean, dogs do too, cats do too. Brindleton Bay. Oh my god, I'm so excited. I'm I'm just pumped. All right, discover the coastal shores of Brindleton Bay as a new world where your sim and their pets can live, enjoy outdoor activities, play fetch near the harbor docks, and take a walk to a lighthouse or visit a park to set up absolute courses. Oh my god, I'm so excited, guys. Okay, but without further ado, we're gonna jump into whatever the first thing is. And um, by the way, if you are gonna be brand new here and you're like, oh, I'm just gonna watch all of this, just skip the intro. Um, it'll be a table content. All, all my videos, especially these ones, except objects. I'm pretty sure Creative Pets will have it. World Tour won't. But I'll always have, like, intro and then actual video. This is my intro for all four videos going forward. And maybe even part one of my LP. I don't know yet. So, just skip this if you heard it a bunch of times. Because I'm just going to jump into whatever I want. And I'll see you guys in one quick second. Going to my Creative review. Um, I'm going to go through all the objects in Creative Starting with the females and go to the the males, and then we're gonna play the genetics and add a toddler to these. I'm gonna delete that toddler. These are the people we're gonna be following in my let's play, so if you want to know more about them, tune in Monday for my cats and dogs part one. But without further ado, let's go over this custom con. Um, okay, so she does. We're gonna get rid of makeup though. Um, eyelashes don't come with this game. The freckles you see are not a part of this game. The white background obviously is not. 
and the skin might look different from your game. I have a few custom content items in my game um, just because I don't really care that much and white backgrounds are easier for me to take pictures and stuff. Oh, I already see. Oh my God, they're so cute. Okay. Oh, dang it. I need to get rid of her every day wear. How annoying that is. Hold on. What if I have to go through each item? As oh, I don't want to take away her eyelashes. Oh, I guess I did. Okay. Well, it happens. Besides so the point. <laughs> me. Oh, oh my god. It's, it's, oh, guys. Oh my god. There's so much. <sighs> okay. All right, let's go through each item. Um, We're going to be showing in blonde. Blonde shows the best texture details. I will jump around to some of my favorite colors that you'll be seeing throughout my LPs. So blonde's very major in my LPs. Brown is brunette. And of course, I do have a few redheads there and there. So we'll go through those styles. Not for each and every one, because as you guys can see here, we don't want to be here all night. Um, and so yeah, so we're going to start with the females first, and we're going to go to males, and then we're going to go to for children and everything. So this, just want to give you a heads up, these videos are going to be long. I'm expecting 40 minutes tops for each and every one of them. So maybe even longer. So just be prepared for that. Join me on the ride. Okay, I'm just excited. Here we go. <gasps> Oh my gosh, this is gorgeous, guys. I've heard rumors that these are beautiful, like on top of beautifulness. So they didn't go like overpowering with cats and dog items. They went genuine like family items. And I'm just so excited for it. Oh, it's beautiful. This hair is creative. It's, it's nice. It's texturized. I like the braid. It's beautiful in different colors. Oh, even looks prettier in brown. I like how the hair is tied around it. This is a very, you know, uh, Della Garcia here on YouTube recently because they're demonetizing so many videos, bad YouTube, um, that she had been, she's doing a lot of blog videos and stuff. And so she created hairstyles in The Sims 4 in real life. And this is a great one she could create too. And that's very nice. I just, I'm, I really like this hairstyle a lot. So, um, already starting off good. All right, let's go to the next one. Oh my gosh, guys, this right here is everything. And like these hairstyles we haven't seen before. There's a lot of them in here that I don't think we've seen before. Oh, guys, this is beautiful. I'm in love. Great, great, great. Just, it's just, it's really cool. I like the texture. The texture in, in the Sims 4, it's just, it's getting better and better. I'm getting excited. Oh, it's even prettier than I thought. Now, my first instinct here, because I'm in love with Will and Grace at the moment, I'm binge watching it. It's Grace from Will and Grace. This is her hair. It's everything. It's beautiful. It's great. Obviously, we've seen a lot in brown lately because it's how they're presenting it. It's just, it's beautiful. I love the volume ties of it. I normally don't like hairs like this, but I feel like I could actually see me putting this on a sim. And that's a great news for the creators. There's a lot of bow hairs. Interesting enough. Oh, I really like this one. I like how it covers the whole head. Now, of course, we have to check and see if the bow does change. It does. Oh my god, the pink is adorable. Oh, the green, obviously, complementary colors. Um, no one likes the, the... Yeah, okay. Then we have this one, which I'm pretty sure is the man bun. So we'll be seeing this again on a dude. Um, so we're not going to go in great detail, great detail over here. Um, this one, oh, it has cats and dog things. So very similar to the last one. And this one is just more flowers. Very interesting that they added three of these. I'm okay with it, though. I'm not, you know, saying anything bad. Um, once again, we're not going to really go through this hair on the sim. I mean, girls can have it. It's perfectly fine. Oh, her braces also, by the way, are not um, a part of an update. Oh my god. I'm in love with the hair, but we can't talk about it. I'm waiting, I'm waiting for these ones to talk about in a different um, light. Alright, so this one, obviously, we've seen a lot of. Um, and I really like the tips. I don't really like the straight edge. I didn't like it in the trailers. I didn't think it looked particularly something I would use. Let's say a lot, but I do like the highlights and I like how they're, they're trying to implement the highlights into the game. Um, cause a lot of people enjoy highlights and so I enjoy highlights and so I like that a lot. I'm also sad we don't have a different color of this hair yet because this isn't really, you know, you can't say this hair in, let's say this hair, which is adorable by the way, um, are the same hair color. It's just, I would like a neutral one of these as well, like they do with this one, which we're about to talk about. All right. Um, this one I don't like. I won't lie. I can see where they're going with this, and anybody who wants to make a Sia, there you go. You can now. But I don't like it. I don't like it. I can I say it's first piece of content I've, I've seen so far. I'm not a big fan of. This one I could see myself using on certain Sims. So even this one works. I just couldn't see myself using this on any Sim. And same with this. I like how it's long though. I mean, I gotta get credit to the creators are trying to make longer and longer hair. 
and you can see this being implemented in several different items in this pack already such as just anything hangs over the shoulders it's really hard to do custom content creators have a hard time doing it as it is so into this okay not talking about this even this is a super cute girl's hair by the way and of course the cat ears we've heard a lot about very interesting the cheese hair and this hair are almost I they're identical okay don't know how I feel about that but we have seen this before I was kind of hoping cat ears was an accessory it is not so but my favorite hair would have to probably be it's between this one and this one because this one's just gorgeous it just started out pretty or this one but I think for Willy Tribble I really like this Willy Tribble is one of my favorite characters that we're created by the way so I'm gonna be referencing her a lot um she's also a zoomer we're decorating so normally she's not normally I don't go with uh these okay cats and dogs have no hats maybe not girls girls might not have any hats ignore my custom content i have a lot of items of it but that's why we're, we're okay so we do have a few necklaces it seems like um very cute necklaces we have a cat and a dog one whichever one you love more she's gonna wear a dog one because we're getting a dog yeah spoiler word there but yeah it's okay um no makeup no nothing and so just it, just ignore me for one quick second um because once your sim has eyelashes, it's hard to see them without eyelashes. I she doesn't look that bad without them, but this is so taking up time. All right, going down to the actual style part of the thing, which is what we all are looking forward to. I can agree, you can agree, lots of custom content on the sim. I've been super excited. I don't really know her style yet, and so I'm happy. I mean, I've been playing with her for a very long time, but I'm just, I'm very curious to see if this will help me. Oh my God, there's so much. And it's all beautiful. Like, I'm just blown away by everything. Even the ones with the paw prints, I can just tell I'm going to fall in love with. All right, you guys ready? Okay, we... Oh, oh, it has a hoodie. Oh, guys, this is great. I love this. This is adorable. This is... See, this is the content that they need to create more often. Like, it's it's unique. It's out there. But it's it's there. It's there. Oh, I'm in love. Okay, that's great. That's a great... Right there. Beautiful. This... I mean, obviously you can tell it's veterinary clinic written all over it, but it's also like every day's business outfit. I really enjoy, um, I can use it on my Paris Legacy Sims. I'm very big fan of this. This one I saw on a Sim and I was like, I need this. This right here is beautiful. This is what makes my life, okay guys? And I'm okay with having some animal prints on too. I think it just brings it all together. Oh my God, this LP is just, oh, I'm just, I, I'm, I'm a fire gasted of how much this is so beautiful. That shirt right here. Sorry, I was still shocked over this one. Um, this one over here. But this one's very pretty too. We need more sweaters and I love, love some good scarves. So very pretty. Scarves could mean certain things. We're not going to talk rumors though. This sweater is beautiful. I'm in love with this sweater. And this sweater. Oh, it's like a big sweater. Oh, guys, I'm in love with this. Oh, the craters. You guys are doing amazing. Just absolutely amazing. Okay, uh, cat sweaters. I'm into dog sweaters. This is beautiful. This is everything, guys. Let's not judge them. Let's not judge your sim, because you all know we're going to put some sims in it. And I even like this one. I like the creative decals, because I know I'm going to get a custom content version that doesn't have the creative decals. And so I enjoy the creative decals. And of course, we do have some direct vet clinic outfits as pre-planned and usual. It's very beautiful, guys. I'm in love. Now, of course, I'm pretty sure this one takes the kicker. It's either this one or this one. I mean, these three right here are absolutely gorgeous. I love the cat sweater, too. But I think this one is just really pretty. But I'm going to leave her topless because I don't know what type of pants we'll have with this or skirts. And they could be high-waisted. I want to see every detail. So, let's just go ahead. Oh, there's only a few. I'm perfectly fine with that. I have enough items in my life. But this is right here. I love how they're starting to use like accessories and stuff. It's a big thing of mine. I love accessories. This is super cute. Um, these, this is a, these are shorts. I couldn't tell. So I don't know if that was intentional or not. But they're also cute. Um, not as amazing as I would hoped. But this skirt, I need more of these kind of skirts. I'm into that. Um, this looks like a recolor of that skirt, just with some cat things, which I'm a big fan of to have a recolor. 
And of course we do have pajama pants or maybe these are, oh no, I would say these are probably are some vet clinic outfits. Now, I won't lie, I'm not blown away by these outfits, these items. This one's pretty cool, I gotta admit, but I'm not super stoked by them. So, that's a little bit alarming, but oh my god, I'm crying. <laughs> I'm like, that's a little bit alarming. Go in here. Um, guys, can we just have like everything? Oh, oh my god, guys. Okay, let's start with these. This right here, if this doesn't scream grandmother's house, I don't know what does. This is everything. This is beautiful. I like how they tie in the top where it's like an add on piece. I like the different different colors. I like the color schemes. I like how you can see it's knitted together. It's just beautiful. Now, of course, this one we've seen a bunch, especially this outfit alone. I thought these were going to be jeans separate, different top. I make sure I'm going to grab those when they do come out custom content because I would love to use this top with some of those different outfits and these, these jeans are very cute. So I'd enjoy those. But this outfit alone, very beautiful. This dress, guys, this dress gives me so much life. It's not even funny. I love these type of dresses. These are like the type of dresses that you live for. You know what I mean? They're just everything, okay? Then let's not even start talking about how much I'm in love with this alone. This beats everything in the game. I'm just kidding. I don't know about that yet. We'll, we'll see. Oh my god, they just keep getting better and better. This is adorable, guys. Oh, no, don't go down. Don't go down. I don't want to see it. Oh, this is adorable. I love the color swatches. These are, oh my gosh. Can you imagine throwing like a 50s diner and having your waitress with this hair and this? It just screams 50s. I love it. I love it. I love it. Oh, guys, this overall set. Oh, okay. Well, dress is very pretty, but I'm not going to freak out about it yet. Okay, I also want this shirt on side note, so hopefully you can get one of those creators to grab me this shirt. And these overalls are adorable, and I would love to have these overalls just with the side boob, so I can um, put a accessory shirt underneath it. I love ex I love tearing apart these outfits and grabbing all the nitty gritty stuff. It's my one of my favorite things. Um, just like this, I need this as an accessory. Just saying. Now, once again, we have some futuristic outfits here brings up my question what are they planning don't know we're not going to talk conspiracy theories if you want to go ahead and comment down below of course conspiracy theories can be chat away down below but oh my gosh they're really bringing my eyes tears to my eyes guys and of course i love me some maxi dresses oh hey look at this it's the same exact thing except this one's more grandmother like where this one's more i don't know more motherish but of course, okay, I gotta say, which ones take the top kicker? This is a hard choice. I'm gonna go with this outfit up here because I really wanna see what the creators do to take it apart. So this is more like a work in progress. This right here, obviously, um, is everything. This is something I've been wanting in the game for a very long time. Overall, we always need more of those. And this outfit, come on, guys. Can you just not talk about how beautiful that is? And of course, I do love this. I, I love them all. I'd be lying. But I think this is my favorite one that we've gotten so far. It's just beautiful, guys. It's absolutely... Oh, no. Go away. Absolutely just beautiful. Okay. So now, let's look and see. So we have this this cat thing. I think it's a cat. And oh my god. Do you see how like it glows? That's really cool. Oh, I think I'm figuring out her style as we go along. Then we have Crazy Cat. Um, I'm pretty sure it'd be amazing if they have some doggies. They do! Oh, do they have some, like, better color doggies? Like, ones that I can match? I mean, to be honest with you, I know some people who'd probably match this, so. No lie. Alright, let's see if they give us any more shoes. They look like we have two new pairs, but I just want to make sure. Because sometimes they can um, rearrange them. Nope. And, to be honest with you, I'm pretty impressed by these. These are pretty cute. I won't lie. They're a little out there, a little different. But I'm very much into the difference. And then, of course, can we just talk about how beautiful these shoes are? They're adorable. Okay? They're adorable. But I think these ones take the kicker for me. I mean, I like objects that I can use with any type of outfit. And these ones you can almost use with any type of outfit. But I still feel like I'd put more boots with this one. Alright, guys. That is the female. Oh, hold on. We got to check talk twos. I highly doubt it. But we could get some cat ones. Um, nope. Okay. Just had to check them real quick. Alright. 
So this is the female version. All right, we're going to jump on over into the male. Hopefully it doesn't take 14 minutes. But hey, um, we'll see. All right. I'm super excited. All right, you guys ready? I'm so excited. This is Max. Um, he is from Get Together, by the way. He's somebody that um, my... Dang it. Oh, I keep doing this. All right. That's okay. Oh, guys. Guys. All right, so I was right. This is super cute. We need more man buns. I'm into it. Give us more. And I like how the like hair is like all way around and stuff. Do you want to see it in multiple colors? I can, I can do that for you. Just to give you guys a color selection. Some crazy colors as well. Um, Because I can't... This is really cute. This will be in my LP probably. Uh, not this LP. I have a new LP that's coming up in a few few weeks. I'll probably make its appearance there. Or maybe one of these will... Oh, I really like the razor shaped. These, it's very um updated and stylish. And I like how there's multiple versions of them. Very big in stuff. That's, that's very nice. There are multiple, multiple versions. Okay. I can understand why, though. I can understand. I can see it. This one, obviously, like I said, very blown away. Very over-exaggerated, and I enjoy that. This one would look cute on, like, a taller. I won't lie, so. And, of course, they get the, the cat ears thing, too, which is adorable. I'm happy for them. And then this looks like more of, like, an old man cut. But I gotta say, probably takes the kicker here. Not I'm normally not too blown away by male hairstyles and stuff like that, but happened oh what is what is this sock okay no no that's gonna be really interesting on townies because i'm not putting oh i know who i could put that on though so there's that <laughs> i figured it out okay um let's go down to accessories because there is some gold down here um now the gold with the hairs is the fact that female hairs can be transferred over to male hairs and so it's just letting you know they have the same exact necklaces. I'm going to give him a dog necklace as well. We'll check traits and stuff in a minute. Remind, I'll remind myself. Obviously, you can't remind me. This is not live. Would you guys let me do live streams? I'm not really there yet. I'm, I can't. I'm not there yet. All right. I do want to just go ahead and give him a little beard. Maybe a little lighter beard. Because... This looks so much cuter with one. All right, down to the actual eye objects. Oh my my! All right, they're all right here. I'm pretty blown away. Um, I don't know if he's ripped. Oh, he is. Ooh, Max, did not know. All right, let's go through. Him. Okay, this right here is adorable. I've seen it before. It's on one of the gay, one of the members of the gay couple that, of course, we become best friends with and everything. So yeah, that's adorable. This right here. I love Sea by the Water outfits, where you can just tell he's like a fisherman. I just love those outfits. I think they're so casual, so hippie, and I love hippie wear, so very big fan of that. Um, this one's creative. I don't understand why there's two pockets. Looks like it maybe got cut in half. I'm into it, though. I'm into it. I won't lie. I'm also into this. This right here, definitely going to be used on some teenager sims. Very into multiple verse wear here. Um, I'm in love with more jacket type items. These are just great. I just, and also, maybe they can get that shirt for me. I'd be into that. <laughs> um, this, oh, I need something like this. I don't know, I've been blown away with cast items. There's, oh, there's so much. Normally they like jip the mails. Oh my, the watered down denim. Did not know I wanted it until I had it. <laughs> um, this looks like exact version of a female version we had before. And I just like it, I like it for male as well. And I'm not really talking about deep, deeply, but we are virgin on long, so trying to talk real fast. I like this one too. This one definitely Max would be all over. So very, very into. Oh my word, this is adorable. Also, uh, I can't say. It. Never mind. We're not going there. If you have any theories down below, please list them. I love these long things. They're adorable. Okay, this is a turtleneck. Oh, Max could so kill a turtleneck. Oh, guys. Okay, and obviously the grandpa sweaters. I love them. Oh, weaves. No comment. You guys are getting that. Are you guys getting what I'm pushing? No? Well, we can talk about it in a different video. I promise. Okay. To be honest with you, I love them all. There's not one in here I don't love. Um, so probably my favorites would be this one, the turtleneck. This one. This one, this one, this one, this one, this one, this one, all them. Just, just, 
Hi, we love, you know. <gasps> oh, God. Do you see these? Yes. 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 They're understanding my style. Ooh, I really like how this is like boho too. I didn't really realize that. That's pretty cool. I like the necklace. <laughs> didn't really realize it with the girls. Oh, more shorts, need more of those. I like the different colors. These are really cool. I really enjoy these. Wasn't thinking I was going to. I hate patterns. I think they make it look too alpha for me. Even Max Smash Off stuff is pretty cringe worthy. Um, but that's pretty cute. I like these. I like these too. Definitely can see a Max pulling off some of these. And of course, some of those. But I think these ones for me definitely take the kicker. Max is so freaking cute. And we only have one body wear. It's perfectly fine. Because it's freaking adorable, guys. I'm screaming your ear. I'm so sorry. But it's adorable. It really is. It blows me away. But I have to say, because they did such an amazing job, I'm not complaining that we only have one. Now, what would I say I put Max in? I think Max is, like I said, I think Max would definitely turn on a turtleneck. But like a turtleneck with like a something else. So maybe not to start off with. Maybe this one. And I, I would have to say probably these. Oh, so cute. You see how we can just match outfits? Okay, no, new things. And, oh, no, they didn't. Oh, my gosh, The Sims. Thank you for adding another type of one of these shoes. These shoes are my favorite shoes in the game. There's literally one just like them. Um, are they under loafers? Okay, hold on. Let's get rid of cats and dogs here. These, I use these all. These and these and these all the freaking time. And they're like hospital made shoes type things. They're just adorable, okay? We need more of them. Okay, that's the male stuff. Blown away by cast. They are literally outdoing themselves. Let's jump on in and let's give them. We'll start with a good old tower. Um, for anybody who was wondering what their kid might look like. Well, here we go. All right. Oh, um, let's check traits real quick. Uh, okay, we do have animal. We want to be friend of the animals and want to be friends with animals. So we do have a whole new section. Pretty good. Uh, can we... Oh, I can I not change them? Okay, we'll, we'll look at them. Don't worry. Alright, let's go down to her. No new hairstyles. Do we not have... I know we have new tower items. I'm aware. Okay, this is new. Okay, that's cute. And we also have this new outfit. Towers are still new to the game. Maybe not. We're going, we're getting to a year. So the lackluster content, we did just get a tower pack though. So I can't really say much. Maybe the girls have a hair. No. Okay. Maybe. Oh, they do have a new, they do have like one of these, which is really cute as well. So, and they also have um, the, the sweater, which is also cute. All right. So let's go to children. Hold on. I don't think they'll give us, yeah, didn't think so. All right, let's go to children. Those are toddler stuff, very two minute type thing. Okay, let's go to children. Let's see if children have any new traits. Oh, cat lover and dog lover, those are new. And okay, and then they don't have any new aspirations, but they do have cat lover and dog lover. Oh, wow, guys, do you see this hair? O M G. What is up with the Sims craters and doing so amazing? You know, they kind of look like each other. I like this. Okay, we're not going to start there. We're going to start here. Oh, these. Okay, this one looks more female. We're going to try to do. I mean, I'm not really against gender swapping. You guys know this um, if you watch my channel. If you don't, you know, I'm surprised you're sticking around this long. But hey, thank you. Um, we're going to also look at some pants. Okay, so we'll look at male stuff. But we do have this cute little cat and dog dress. And um, I was looking for some clear ones. Oh, we do have a few clear ones. Oh, so cute. Ready for Christmas. Oh, in love. Okay. Let's move you over to a boy, sweetie. Alrighty. Oh, we do. And oh, it is so cute. So, so cute. Ah. Oh, if you know me, I'm in love with these hairs. So, very, very much into those. And then, I love this shirt. This is an adorable shirt. I like this jacket a lot. Always into kids' mind. More kids' eyes. I don't care what they look like. I'm into them. Okay, this right here, though, that's pretty much everything. Just saying. Oh, I take it back. 
this is everything. That probably takes the kicker. This is close second though. All right, and um, oh, the shorts are mainly for females. Interesting. <gasps> Ooh, nice cute outfit, and and our first little accessory for children. <laughs> Makes me so happy and excited. Um, shoes wise, yeah, kind of actually does look like we might have a few. Let's see here. We have two. We have some boots, and we have some lower work smaller boots almost like rain boots like i said the hints here are just oh not toddler children and i want you and i want these shorts oh these are cute i'm into these i like these um and females have these rain boots instead or uggs very interesting choices gotta say all right now we're gonna make you a teenager so i can see Oh my gosh, they make such a cute child. Oh, cannot wait. All right, let's see here. So we do have cat lover and dog lover. So let's, let's look at these. Oh, so, okay. And see if dog lover is the same thing. Yep, all right. And then, um, of course, we need to check and see what... Okay, that's it. That's perfectly fine. Very understandable. And that's what the animal thing is. And you can get animal affection from animals can higher values with you. But guys, that is my review of the cat, the Creative Sim items. Of course, if I did miss anything, comment down below. I always love hearing things that I miss so I can look at them myself. But I'm blown away by this cast items. These are probably my favorite cast items in all of Sims. Oh, take that back. There's a few things that I like a little more, but they're up there on high number of lists. These are beautiful. I recommend so far at part one of my review because this will probably go up first i have a feeling i always do creative sims first um part one of my or creative pen mine so maybe part two part one or part two of my review buy it i cannot tell you how much you need to spend the 40 dollars. okay if you have it please do get it or live vicariously through me or any other career you do enjoy because i have a feeling this is gonna be the best thing ever but yeah I'll see you guys all next time for another beautiful, lovely video. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment. And please do remember I'm having coverage of cats and dogs all week in between the 10th, 11th, and 12th. And my LP starts on the 13th. Or if you're watching this later on in the future, my LP is probably already out. So check that out too. I love you all. Please do hit the subscribe button because I want more human people. I am a human squad person. I call you my lovely humans for reasons. Love you all. See you all tomorrow.